As people, we all learn from experience. We know red means stop, green means go. And we also know that some brands just make us feel really great when we purchase them. In the end, we all prefer companies that give us a good experience and law firms are no different. Law firms that provide an exceptional experience are remembered, they're valued, and chances are if you're operating in a niche or small focus market, what people perceive of your brand in that market and the experience of your brand in that market will be even more important than for bigger brands. The thing is, bigger brands seem to lead the way on creating great client experience. One example is Apple. Good morning. Welcome back to Apple Park for our second event in just over a month. Unlike so many other companies, when Apple launches a product, it's an event. The reason for this is that they're more meaningful, they're more memorable, and they've built a client experience around everything that they do. Today, Apple is going to reinvent the phone. This doesn't necessarily mean the products are better. It just means the overall experience connects more to their consumers. Apple makes sure to craft this experience into every touch point with the brand, whether it's in-store, whether it's unboxing, whether it's their advertising, no matter where you see Apple and all the touch points, it's consistent about its experience. Even their taglines are all about making a personal connection. Think different, be you. It's all about that personal connection to the brand. In the end, by making this consistent connection through all of their potential touch points, Apple have been able to grow fans and a community that believes in their product. So what does this have to do with law firms? Well, the reality is that most firms survive on referral and return work. So the brand experience is just as important for law firms as it is for Apple. In fact, you could argue it's way more important for law firms than it is for Apple because of the ramifications for clients and the costs involved. The thing with customer experience though is that it's fragile. It can be built quickly and lost quickly. A recent PwC publication outlined that about 32% of respondents would leave an organization if the client experience decreased, even if they had a good experience in the past. In the end, consistently great client experience builds trust in your brand and from your clients. As lawyers, we're taught to solve problems, not necessarily deliver solutions in the best possible way. So there's a huge amount of opportunity for firms who can get it right. The thing with client experience though, as Apple shows, is that it permeates all touch points with your firm's brand, whether that's online, in person, during the sales process, with your social media, with your marketing materials, with how someone is greeted on the phone or when they come to your offices. Every touch point is an opportunity to create a great experience that will be remembered. Think about your website. It's a great opportunity to build an excellent client experience. Now, most people don't think of it like that because they think of it as a sales tool. But when you go to a website that solves your problem, that answers your question in a real way, that makes you feel a connection to that brand, you're going to prefer that brand over a competitor. Clients are assessing you on the basis of your branding and your website. A recent study by Super Offers showed that about 57% of respondents wouldn't recommend a business if they had a poor web experience. The big takeaway from Apple and other successful brands is to realize that client experience is part of everything that you do. It's part of your branding, it's part of your marketing, it's part of your service delivery, and it drives what you do. Because in the end, you want to create the feeling of community and a feeling of connection with your brand. And let's be honest, we all remember that great experience. We all tell our friends about that great experience and you want your business to be the business that everyone's talking about. If you enjoy this video, please like and subscribe for more.